He's warning users of security flaws that could allow hackers to take complete control of your device. Dina Demetrius tells us the vulnerabilities may have already been actively exploited. Apple quietly released two security reports on Wednesday revealing vulnerabilities for iPhones, iPads, and Macs. This is what we call a zero-day vulnerability when it's been uh, exploited by a hacker before the company, in this case Apple, uh, have detected it and been able to do something about it. The company believes the two security flaws are related. One affects the browser engine that powers Safari and other apps, and the second would potentially allow hackers full access to your device. Hackers can actually have admin rights to those devices, so that means that they have access to all of the information. The affected Apple devices include iPhone 6S models and later, iPad 5th generation and later, iPad Air 2, and all iPad Pro models. Mac computers running the Monterey operating system as well as some iPods. Apple did not say where the vulnerabilities were discovered or by whom, citing only an anonymous researcher. Experts say these security flaws are inevitable when technologies are constantly evolving. This is really a function of the fact that they're innovating, they're constantly developing. I think what's important here is that they have made that update available, uh, and it seems that they've done that really quickly. Affected users are advised to install those updates immediately. Dina Demetrius, CBS News, Los Angeles.